Hawaii Island Bureau Chief Jeremy Lee was at the Edith Kanakaole Stadium this weekend to talk to vendors arriving from across the islands for the big event. It's not yet Thanksgiving, but that doesn't stop Hilo from this annual tradition. The Christmas extravaganza here in the Hilo. This is the 34th year. This is my first year. Are people spending this year so far? Yes. Yeah, it's been very good. Absolutely, yes. <laughs> it's exciting. <laughs> Thousands of shoppers and over 100 vendors presenting handmade goods. This is our Christmas tea. This is my favorite. Everybody loves peacock cakes, right? And we look at these headpieces here. These are made out of uh, silk. So we're using these are the ohia. We got red, pink, yellow. And these are for your papales. So you stick them out to your papales like this. Vendors say it's a chance to meet customers face to face. Many vendors coming from as far off as California, <laughs> Maui. But the majority of them are from Hilo. And the thing that's unique about this show, it's a handmade only show. KK12 and under got in free, otherwise the low price of a $2 admission draws in customers for a more personal connection. It's an authentic connection, it's a tie between the vendors and the people that come to shop. We get to meet a lot of people from the mainland, local, it doesn't matter. As the owner of this local Big Island farm put it. It's so festive, it's happy, um, and it's a chance to like really showcase all of our products. It uh, brings us a lot of wholesale customers from other islands. We've met a few people from Kauai already. Um, so it's really nice to get our, our name out there, get our products out there, and also to meet all of the wonderful people here in Hilo. In Hilo, Jeremy Lee, KITV4 Island News.